welcome to diplomacyindia.com. I am here at the press center, which is the venue of the second World Nomad Games. Today we have a journalist from Malaysia. Her name is Ms. Suryadis Sanusi. Uh, she works for the Barnama News Channel. Today we are going to talk to her about her experiences of covering the World Nomad Games. So, welcome to diplomacyindia.com. Uh, I would like to know what was your experience of covering these games, how were the arrangements and I could find a lot of interest in foreign media covering these games. So I would like to have my, like to know your experience. My experience, well, coming from a country which we do not have nomadic people uh, to a country which they are rich in nomadic uh, stuff and, and experiences. So for me, it's very enlightening to see games that we do not have in back in our own country, like with horses and with eagles. So for us to represent Malaysia, to, to watch the games with our, our own eyes, I guess it would be a great uh, experience that we could save it for the rest of our lives. Okay. How many games were you able to cover or see? We managed to cover a lot, yeah. uh, mostly at the Kirchen Gorge, where we saw the eagles and the falcon and also dogs. Uh, we also managed to catch a lot of the uh, wrestling matches and also at the hippodrome games uh, that, that consists of horses uh, like uh, like the Kokwara uh, and uh, two more like Churid and the uh, Air Ernish. Uh, if I could ask you uh, one moment which you would always remember about these games. One moment that I will always remember about this game. Well, I guess it would be the Eagles game. Uh, for obvious reason, because we do not have an eagle that big in Malaysia. To watch them uh, compete as an athlete. You know, the athletes are just there to just tell them what to do. But the, the real athlete is the eagle. So to see them competing for the game, it's really, really and uh, how was the overall preparation uh, in terms of you know providing media facilities or uh, how did you see the foreign media covering it? Foreign media, I think, I, I guess it's the same thing with all of us. They are very excited. It's only the second World Nomad Games. It's still very new. So I guess everyone is like, do not know what to do, do not know what to expect. But what they can see is something really, really interesting and very exciting for them. And I guess coverage would be, um, I guess it's really much covered everything uh, because like I said this is not Olympics where it, you know, it's over overexposed, people know what kind of games, this is like really brand new games, so I guess uh, they have covered it quite well. And uh, if you talk about the press facilities, mm -hmm. how were the facilities and the press facilities? Press facilities, I, might, I have to say that over here at the Hippodrome and the, at the uh, Fox I think everything is okay, it's up to date, but I guess uh, the ones that are at the Kirchen Gorge and uh, some other places are quite vague. We do not know where to go and how to find places and things like that. It was not really clear where to go or where is the venue specifically. Anyway, Surya, thank you very thank much. Thank you so for much. Thank you, so much. thank you so much. This is Amay Sakni at the press center, the venue of the second World Nomad Games, Isukul Lake, Kyrgyzstan.